Michigan Outdoors On Demand is brought to you by Country Smokehouse of Almond, offering the best quality and satisfaction in homemade meat, sausage, and jerky. Check out the website at countrysmokehouseinc.com. Hey, this is uh, Tony Hansen. I'm the editor of Michigan Outdoors Magazine and the deputy director with Michigan uh, United Conservation Clubs. Just pulling the boat out of the water, and uh, this is something that means an awful lot to us at MECC and uh, Michigan Outdoors Magazine, and that's fishing. And not because it makes us money or because it brings money to Michigan. Those are all good side benefits. But we love fishing just because it's what we do and it's who we are. It's what we believe in. Um, I can't imagine what my life would be like if I didn't have the opportunity to fish. But, you know, everything we love can go away pretty fast. Um, Asian carp is something you've heard a lot about. You're going to hear a lot more about them. Unfortunately, so far the news has been all bad. Uh, they're in the Chicago Canal. They're right on the doorstep of Lake Michigan. There's actually been DNA from Asian carp found in Lake Michigan. Um, that's all bad news because those fish have shown that they can take over um, a fishery. They can absolutely destroy all of the other habitat, they can outcompete the other fish and we could have you know some some of our rivers and our Great Lakes where there's nothing in them except Asian carp and that's just unacceptable. Been a lot of talk about what to do about it, um, you know a lot of legislative action but really there hasn't been any results. We've heard so many excuses, so many um, debates over this and the bottom line is they need to close those locks on the canal and keep those fish out. Lost in all the discussion is the fact that fishing is really important, not just because of the money, like I said, but because it's who we are and it's what we do. And so we've decided um, to do something about that. And on June 8th, we're going to do an event that I think is going to be pretty cool, and we really hope everybody will get behind it, and we're calling it the 3030 Fishathon. Uh, what we're going to do, myself and Gabe Van Warmer, the producer for MichiganOutdoors.com, we're going to fish 30 straight hours and we're going to try to catch 30 different species of fish in Michigan by any legal means. Um, for every fish that we catch, we're accepting pledges. So um, you can go on our website, MichiganOutdoors.com, click on the 3030 link and make a pledge. Any dollar amount is fine. It's not about the money. It's about showing the support and all of the fishing industry and all the anglers in this state getting behind this. So. Let's say you, you pledge a buck and we catch 24 different species, your total pledge would be $24.
Our fundraising goal is $15,000. But again, it's not about the money. Our real goal is to show people that fishermen care about the resource and that people really should be talking about the impacts on us as anglers, not just the financial impacts, but what it means to our lifestyles and um, really, you know, the way of life that we love here in Michigan. So check out the website and uh, we'll see you on the water. Well, I'm putting the finishing touches on this week's OD show, and not only did we want to tell you about the 30-30 attempt that we're going to be doing in June, but we also wanted to show you what our intern's been up to. Tim Jock has been our intern for about two months now, and he had a chance the other day to take one of his friends out turkey hunting, and it turned out really good. Yeah, it's May 9th, uh, Mother's Day. Um, hopefully uh, I get a bird quick so that <laughs> I can get back to my wife. Uh, spend some time with her and, the, and my son. Uh, I was out here a couple weeks ago, and uh, or excuse me, a couple days ago. Had some birds, but nothing I could uh, get a shot at, just one Jake. So we'll see what we can do.
did something wrong. You might want to take that. Take that shot. Take it. Um, second bird I've got, this is uh, bigger than my first, so nice bird, nice beard. So what do you think of this on Eric? Oh, this is awesome. Mother's Day, I'm glad my wife let me come out. Nice bird, about strutting, perfect, came right in. Um, just couldn't ask for a better hunt. We're in Genesee County right now on the May 9th, and uh, me and Tim came out. And he did some great calling and that's what I end up with. That's it, eh? That's it. Good hunt. We're done by, packed up by 7.30 in the morning, Mother's Day, so I can go home and spend some time with uh, my wife and kid.